2021 has been a tough year in many ways, but there have been some lighter moments here on the news, including numerous fun animal stories. And this is one of our funnest things to do for the year, Colleen. Every year in late December, we like to present our top seven favorite animals of the year. So here is the list for 2021. At number seven, we have seen lots of bears behaving badly this year, but this one takes the cake. Actually, he takes the chicken. This was in Sierra Madre. A bear broke into a home and helped himself to a bucket of KFC. The bear climbing on the counter for his fried chicken feast. The homeowner told us that he sees bears near his house often, but never inside. And he said the smell of that KFC must have just been too tempting. <laughs> That is the sound of a turkey mimicking a police siren. At number six, a Washington state trooper was making a traffic stop, noticed a turkey on the side of the road that seemed to be copying the sound of his siren. Who knew? Apparently, turkeys are pretty good at parroting. Pretty awesome. And number five, sharks that can glow in the dark. Scientists in New Zealand discovered kite fin sharks, which grow to about six feet long, can glow with bioluminescence. And that makes them the largest vertebrates on Earth that can emit the cool neon light. Scientists think that the sharks glowing underbellies help them hide from predators beneath them. Mm, and from a glowing shark to a swimming bald eagle, at number four, this is our national symbol, a bald eagle doing his best, Michael Phelps impression on a lake in Minnesota. Now, it's not something you see captured on video often, but bald eagles are, eagles are actually pretty good swimmers, we're told. Birds of prey sometimes swim in order to grab fish, ducks, and other sources of food. Well, number three, invasion of the cicadas they were a big deal this year in parts of the US and uh, they only emerge from the ground every 17 years so once they finally come out pretty gross they do so in huge numbers giving many people the creeps but for entom entomologists it was all very exciting take a look I know some people will be afraid oh. of cicadas but hey <laughs> cicadas don't bite cicadas don't sting sometimes they will try to get in your mouth Sometimes they might try to walk up your face. Sometimes it may be difficult to speak when you have cicadas hanging on your front lip. <laughs> I, I, I remember being a kid doing exactly that. Now, the last time we saw swarms of these every 17 year cicadas was way back in 2004 when George W. Bush was president, and we won't see it again until 2038. Wow. Well, number two, even tortoises are using oh. video chat more during the pandemic. This year, two endangered Galapagos tortoises had their first date via FaceTime. 70-year-old Hugo ready to settle down, so Estrella moved from Germany to Australia to meet him, but had to quarantine for several months first. So they had to begin their romance with virtual dating before finally meeting face-to-face. -face. But now the two tortoises are together at last. Oh, all right. Even they could find love. Yeah. Well, number one is awesome, Colleen. An epic <laughs> video conference fail for this cat who's actually not really a cat at all, of course, but an attorney who couldn't figure out how to turn off his cat filter, resulting in a priceless viral video moment. I believe you have a filter turned on in the <laughs> video settings. Uh, you might want to... Uh, uh. Take Take we're trying to, we're tr can you hear me, Judge? I can hear you. I think it's a filter. It, in the it is, and I don't know how to remove it. I've got my assistant here. She's trying to, but uh, I'm prepared to go forward with it. That's, I'm here live. It's not, I'm not a cat. Oh, man, the sincerity in his voice is just, just makes it priceless. The judge here authorized the release of the video to show the legal community's commitment to justice under difficult circumstances. The lawyer in that cat filter said that he is glad that people got a good laugh from it. And that is a great one. That is, uh, David, that would be one of us doing that, not being able to turn off that filter. <laughs> totally. <laughs> Hello, I'm Mark Brown. Get more great ABC7 content by clicking the subscribe button for our YouTube channel. And download the ABC7 Los Angeles streaming app on Fire TV, Android TV, Apple TV, and Roku to watch on your TV.